Basin Stoke town manager Frank Gray said last week that he had no intention of man marking Dover Athletics top goal scorer Adam Birchall. However, after just three minutes on Saturday, he may have been regretting that decision after the former Arsenal trainee was put through to give the away side an early lead. It's a real chance this. It's Adam Birchall for Dover. Swats it home. 1-0 Dover Athletic. Mason so created little in chances, but a route one ball and a defensive lapse by Dover allowed Greg Draper to break free and score his 14th goal of the season. A long kick up field, oh I say it's gone all the way through. And it's Draper for Basingstoke, a sublime finish from Greg Draper. Real route one football. The striker grabbed his second of the match, beating a defence for pace and slotting past goalkeeper Ross Flipney. And it's Draper again, Basingstoke take the lead. And Draper completed his hat trick, swooping in to finish a Rob Rice long throw. Nice, and it's Draper again! Wow, would you believe it? It's 1 2 3 for Greg Draper, a superb hat trick for Basingstoke's number 10. The Kent Bay side pulled one back early in the second half through Birchall's 33rd goal of the season, and they continued to press the Basingstoke defence in search for an equaliser. Dragons keeper Simon Lock reacted expertly to deny Dover's Ben Hunt. from the resulting corner, the away side threatened again, having an opportunity cleared off the line. But it was in vain as Basingstoke held on to pinch all three points. Manager Gray was full of praise for his side's performance. Great result, fantastic result. Let's say a bad start in both halves. First half and second half, we're a bit sloppy. Um, but thankfully we've, we've turned it around first half. Three great finishes from Greg Draper. Um, give us a good lead and we didn't want to start the second half like we did, that's for sure. You can see them in the first minute, put us under pressure for most of the second half, but they never really, they had one or two scrambles without actually having any sustained pressure on us, but uh, we held out well and it's a, like I say, it's a fantastic three points for us. Gareth Messenger, Winchester News Online.